Cameras are rolling through the terrifying moments as a man with a gun tries to rob a Valley Motel. The only thing I know is he's, he's not getting back past me. And you can see in this video, the guy jumps up on the counter trying to get to the cash. 13 Action News reporter Brian Callahan spoke with the clerk to find out what he was thinking as he stared down the barrel of the gun. You can see in the video, Joe Kelly thought he was dealing with a regular customer walking into the Desert Moon Motel when he asked if he could help him. He said, yes, you can help me. You can give me your money. At that point, you see the gun come out, but Kelly remained calm. I didn't think it, it was real at first. He didn't look comfortable with it. It was way out here, it, and it was in his left hand. It just didn't look right. But watch as the would-be robber gets frustrated, leaping on top of the five-foot-tall counter, again shoving the gun in Kelly's face, demanding cash. This is it right here. This is where I make my stand. Kelly says he knew there were two people sleeping in the back area, so he continued blocking the way, eventually showing the crook an empty money bag. And he cocked his head, looked at me real funny got down and left. He says he then did something he now considers stupid, running after the would-be robber. I was hoping to get a picture of the car, a plate number, something. Weeks later, police still have not caught the would-be crook, saying the case remains open. While he's still shaken by the crime, Kelly says he doesn't think he'd do anything different if it happened again. I don't think I would have changed anything. I would still be calling myself stupid the next time. Kelly says he hasn't talked to the detectives since the initial crime. He's hoping to touch base with them in the coming days, but he says until then he's going to come out here, look both ways for trouble down the street before heading back into the office. Reporting on Fremont Street, Brian Callahan, 13 Action News.